Now, you may know him best as a lawyer on Ray Donovan or a doctor on House. Now, Peter Jacobson is taking on a new role as a cunning politician in USA's new series, Connolly. Yeah. Colony. <laughs> <laughs> the show centers on one family's struggle to survive and bring liberty to an occupied L.A. Take a look. Our hosts are here for our benefit. Come out there with me, Snyder. Not the greens on the flats. Let me show you a few things and then tell me if you still believe that. There need to be some controls in place, otherwise it'd be anarchy. But all of this, it's temporary. Once they've satisfied their needs, they'll leave. Everything will go back to normal. Everything or will, will it. Or will it. Exactly. <laughs> Peter joins us now live with all the answers. Congratulations. <laughs> Everybody's you. talking about this show. Yeah. Great ratings after the second episode air. I mean, it's just getting better and better. How would you describe for anyone who hasn't seen it the premise of this show? Uh, in a nutshell, in a, a nutshell. mysterious foreign occupation of Los Angeles and possibly beyond and what happens to uh, eight million people and really this family uh, when your lives are turned completely upside down do you resist with this occupying force or do you collaborate yeah. mm. and there's a great uh, team behind this show too it's the executive producer of oh, lost yeah. and a great ensemble <laughs> cast but your character's a juicy character yeah. too so you've been in so many <laughs> successful shows do you have to still audition for these things or? Uh, I do I do you really? did this uh, after today I'm hoping that'll just stop, <laughs> stop. But, why, why um, make I know audition? After, uh, it's you know it's what actors do we audition um, it, sometimes it gets easier and easier as yeah. my, you know, as my career goes on. It certainly gets easier to uh, to get the jobs, and um, sometimes I don't audition. But for this one, I did. Yeah. I read the script and loved it, and it was Carlton Cuse, and I thought, well, who wouldn't want to do this? Right. I certainly want to. Uh, what I love most about it was that rather than just a, it's a juicy character. He's he's not just sort of your straight right down the middle bad guy. There are a lot of different levels to him, yeah. and that's what I really love. He has a little heart too. Yeah. Uh, I read we're going to see down the road. Not not all bad, maybe. No, 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 no. He comes off as being pretty icky in the pilot, but. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> There's nine more episodes to find out all the different layers of yeah. Foxy Snyder. Yeah. Icky, I like that. Yeah. I like that. It's a word I come by easily. Yeah. <laughs> well, a lot of social media support uh, behind the yeah. show, as most television shows these days. And right. you are new to Twitter. I it's mean, what, what took you so long? I, well, I'm getting on there in years, so I sort of missed the initial boat. Right. Um, <laughs> now it's a very weird part of my life. I, I enjoy it. It's great. It's amazing to connect real time yeah. to fans of the show. And there's so many fans, and they're there, and I find myself talking to them, yeah. and it's great. Do you like, how many people are you following? I'm following, I don't know, I think in <laughs> like the hundreds, three, and oh. I have something like, I think there's Justin Bieber, and then me, and then Beyonce right, in terms right, of followers. Right, right. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a little scary, because I go yeah. way over the limit of 140, and then I have to cut, I, yeah. don't, know, I don't know what I'm doing. So are you doing it during the show? Uh, yes, yeah. we've been live tweeting, live tweeting, and I'll probably live tweet tomorrow Are as well. Are you going to live tweet then during Ray Donovan? Because I love oh. Ray Donovan. You play a lawyer on Ray Donovan. I have not been asked to live tweet Ray Donovan, but now they that I'm such a pro on Twitter, I'm Drexler. I'd be great at, you know, <laughs> Lee Drexler could really live tweet well. Well, you're a Chicago native, but you go back and forth all the time to L.A. because of work. But you live here in New York, I do. right? So I do. What, what, I've been here for 30 years. What brings you back here to New York? Um, I came here for school when I was uh, right out of college. Uh, my wife is from New York, and uh, and a she's thing. a New Yorker. And so when you marry a New Yorker, there's no leaving New York. Absolutely. And I love it. I just, I mean, I know snowstorms can be obviously more than just fun, but there was something about this last weekend when you just—it's one of those moments when you really just love being in New York. It's so yeah. beautiful. And yeah. Dramatic. We feel the same way. Yeah. We definitely do. <laughs> Even though it's cold. Yeah. <laughs> because I'm from Chicago. That part I right. don't mind. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, be sure to catch Colony Thursdays at 10 p.m. on USA. Peter, it's lovely to meet you. Nice and congratulations to meet you. on the Thank new show. Thank you very much. Bye. Thank you.